to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how I make feathers in Adobe Illustrator. Um, this is just how I do it. There's million, million, gazillion kinds of ways on how to make this. Um, but this is a great method if you don't know how to draw and aren't great at um, drawing stuff. So. We're going to click and hold and grab our ellipse tool by holding down, um, click and drag to make a circle. Okay. Command C, Command V to copy and paste. And we're going to make this one smaller, kind of like this. We are then grab, grab, going to click on the bigger one and press I on your keyboard, click on your background to make it the same color as your background. Now select both ovals. You want to double click here on the blend tool and you're going to go specified steps. I think about a hundred will be okay, but anyways, we can fix this later. Press okay. Then click on both of your shapes and it'll automatically blend the two uh, shapes together. Um, we are now going to click and hold over here where you have the width tool and we are going to look for the scallop tool. All right. You can select the size, you can press control or command, control and alt or option by keeping those pressed, clicking and dragging, you can adjust the size of your scallop tool. And then we're gonna make a straight line from top to bottom, trying to make it as straight as we possibly can. And, all right. Now we're going to grab the ellipse tool again, and we're gonna make a really thin oval shape. Um, we are going to click here to fill it with a gradient. And here you can edit your gradient. So I'm going to click on the lighter color, color picker, and I'm going to select my background color. And for the other color, I'm going to select my feather color. All right. I'm going to place it here in the middle and I can adjust it. And yeah, that's basically it. This is how I make feathers. And we can make another one real quick. Solid color. You can also click and hold the Alt key to make a copy. Make sure that your little copy is in front of the big one. And then we're gonna blend. It's so easy, guys. Uh, so fast. You can also do it multiple times. And you're always gonna get a different effect. Sometimes they're gonna look good, sometimes they're gonna look not so good, but you can always go back and change it. We're gonna move this, right click and arrange, bring to front. And then we're gonna make this smaller leaf. And that's it. Enough. All right. Um, follow me on Instagram. I post all my graphic design stuff there. And follow me on uh, TikTok as well, where I post the short versions of these tutorials. Uh, they're all under one minute. So the really quick versions of these longer tutorials that I post on YouTube. Uh, make sure to subscribe, comment down below. If you have any requests for a tutorial, um, just let me know in the comments. 
and give this video a big thumbs up and I'll see you next video. Bye!